Yellow fever is called yellow fever because the victims of the disease turn a brilliant color of yellow, both in their skin and their eyes. And in fact, it's really more of a, a sallow, sickly yellow rather than a sort of bright, vivid color. And that's caused by uh, buildup of bile and bilirubin in the bloodstream of the victim. Bilirubin is a product that's formed by the liver uh, that goes into the gallbladder and then is then excreted into the small intestine as bile. Bile is there to help break down certain parts of your diet, usually fatty foods and other things, to help digest them as you, as you eat. When the liver fails, the bilirubin can't be excreted and form bile the way that it usually does, and so it backs up into the liver and then into the bloodstream because there are blood vessels that are in the liver as well. And then, so the bilirubin backs up, enters the bloodstream, and causes what's known as jaundice. Jaundice is caused by a, an accumulation of bilirubin in the bloodstream. Bilirubin is usually formed by the liver and is excreted into the small intestine where it helps break down food products. Uh, when the liver is failing, this function can no longer occur. The bilirubin instead enters the bloodstream, can't be broken down in the usual way, and because of its accumulation, causes the yellowing of the skin and the eyes.